Hello YouTube, CJ here. Welcome back to Portal 2. Um, using an Xbox remote this time. And uh, yeah, so where we last left off, we fell down this big elevator shaft. The elevator got stuck. And uh, GLaDOS was a potato who got carried away by a pigeon. <laughs> So, yeah. God, this place looks so cool. It, it, it's so weird how, like... I don't know, this almost looks like a whole, like, underground city. Like, the, the size of, um... I don't know why my portal gun isn't showing up on the, uh... You know what? Doesn't matter. Um, but like, like the size of the facility in this is crazy. Is there not a portal? S oh wait, it's over here, duh. It's, it's, it's crazy huge. Yeah, it looks like a, a like underground city sort of thing. This way, duh. Stupid. Oh. Well. All right, pop a portal there, and another one over there. Okay. Almost fell right through the hole there. That's fine. Like, it's crazy the amount of effort that, like, went into the world building of this game. Because as, as much as I love the puzzles, uh, like, the, the world building and lore also is a huge part of what helped, like, suck me into this game. And made it, like, one of my favorite games. Pop a portal up there. Looks like I can. One there, one there. But yeah, so Wheatley betrayed us, which Honestly, the first time I played the game, I I was like legitimately pretty hurt by that cuz like just how much I like the character. Um although one thing I find weird is like uh, they literally stated that Wheatley is basically supposed to be a moron core. Like he was specifically built to be stupid. Um. Oh wow. Hold on. So. That's a big vault. But yeah, Wheatley was specifically built in order to be stupid. Um. But. Uh. She honestly. Like, he definitely comes off pretty stupid at a lot of points in the game. But at the same time, uh, I honestly have, like, a little bit of a hard time buying him being so stupid that he was, like, the product of a bunch of scientists trying to intentionally build the dumbest robot who ever lived. Uh, I just... I don't know. I have a heart. Like, he seems smarter than that. Uh, Timmy. Um, even if he is pretty stupid. So, I think what I gotta do here is I gotta press... Both of these buttons have to be pressed at around the same time. Uh, probably meant for two people to press it, but I'm gonna cheat with portals because, uh, I can. 
and then watch this vault open. Ah, oh, it's so cool. Yeah, now we can go through here. Uh, I had a bit of a problem with my game there. Hopefully that didn't screw up the recording. Look at this place. Despite the fact that I've played this game before, it just never ceases to amaze me how much they did to build up everything in the in the world. Like I have to wonder like where this lab is is uh, located as well though. Like the Aperture Science Lab, uh, which is, which seems to be like ridiculously enormous, um, and presumably located underground, at least for the most part. Maybe part of it's above ground, part of it's underground. Uh, maybe there's bits of lore that I don't know, and I'm just gonna sound stupid, but like. Where did they put a laboratory, uh, that is this big and has this many levels to it? Can I, can I go in? Yeah? Or am I supposed to go up there somehow? I feel like I am. Uh, I probably gotta go through there first. Alright. Cave Johnson, uh, probably one of the other best characters in the game, even if you never technically actually beat him. Um. Oh. So, um, I completely forget what to do here. Probably that. <laughs> Here I go. <laughs> I love how they set it up just perfectly so that you fly through the Aperture Science logo. There's a thousand tests performed every day here in our enriched spheres. I can't personally oversee every one of them, so these pre-recorded messages will cover any questions you might have and respond to any incidents that may occur in the course of your science adventure. This assignment will vary depending on the manner in which you have bent the world to your will. Those of you helping us test the repulsion gel today 
just follow the blue line on the floor. Those of you who volunteered to be injected with praying mantis DNA, I've got some good news and some bad news. Bad news is we're postponing those tests indefinitely. Good news is we've got a much better test for you, fighting an army of mantis men. Pick up a rifle and follow the yellow line. You'll know when the test starts. <laughs> uh. Dave Johnson, shower curtain salesman of 1943. Local entrepreneur buys salt mine. Dang. Lore! Aperture fixtures. So, I, I guess... I can't remember all the lore that well, but... I guess I, I think Aperture... Now that I think about it, I think Aperture used to be like a... Um, like a company that, that just sold things like... Well, shower curtains. Uh, and was eventually built up into this big science uh, company by uh, Cave Johnson here, who's the guy you keep hearing on the recordings. Is there anything in here? Sorry, I like to explore a lot, uh, even though there's probably nothing in here. Nope. Alright. Welcome test subjects. Please sign in with the receptionist before proceeding to the lounge. Hello, I am here to do test. Goodbye. Elevator control. Oh. I suppose shooting the elevator is not gonna be helpful. got a steam notification. I hope that didn't actually like show up on the recording because that would look weird. Um me think. Portal there, portal there. Um alright. So I think I think I need to get over that way somehow. So the portal surface here. Oh, I'm stupid. I think I need to jump down the elevator shaft. Don't try this at home. I think I need to pop a blue portal at the bottom. Yes! Made it. Nailed it. Did it. 10 out of 10. Gel pressure thing. So now that the gel's activated, we can use it for tests that are coming up. Oh, 
Whew. Okay. So I think this one. They say great science is built on the shoulders of giants. Oh. Not here. At Aperture, we do all our science from scratch. No hand holding. Let's get started. This first test involves something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group, by the way. You get the gel. Last poor son of a gun got blue paint. <laughs> All joking aside, that did happen. Broke every bone in his legs. Tragic, but informative. Or so I'm told. Remember, this test is unsolvable without Aperture Science Portable Quantum Tunneling Device. If you have not received one, please find a test associate before participating in any Shaft 09 enrichment activities. So I guess that's like the, the sort of retro style portal gun um, that they had. Propulsion gel. Gel is a sweeter, slightly less non-toxic form of fiberglass insulation that causes subsequently ingested food items to bounce off the lining of a dieter's. For various reasons, this product was pulled from s s shelves. Is Aperture's first attempt to create a pudding substitute? Nice. Well, here it is. Boing. Alright. Let's see, what do we gotta do here? Uh, okay, so that opens up that door. I need a box, though. I think I might know what to do here. Boing. That should give me a box. So now I can grab the box and put that on the button. Oh. Oh my god! This is the problem you get with uh, repulsion gel. You get the box bouncing all over the place. There we go. The lab boys just informed me that I should not have mentioned the control group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre-recorded messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre-recorded messages. I pay the bills here, I can talk about the control group all damn day. Okay, that's just a tiny office. You gotta love Cave Johnson. <laughs> For this next test, we put nanoparticles in the gel. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are gonna travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumors. Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, don't worry. If you sat on a folding chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants, we took care of that too. Cave Johnson, uh, it may also be a bit, bit fucked up, but... <laughs> Alright, uh, so I gotta get up there, grab the box, and, uh, yeah! <laughs> I brain good. 
I do I do science good with big brain. Okay, well. Eat. There. Now that turn that on. Uh huh. Oh, there we go. Well, I think I can just do this. Oh my god, that's so fun. Boing, 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 boing. <laughs> I probably sound really stupid in these uh, uh, recorded videos. <laughs> That's fine, though. Wait. Wait, where am I supposed to fall from? Hello, YouTube. CJ here. Uh, and sorry for this weird cut halfway through the video. Um, I got called, I had to do something, and, uh, I'm actually recording the second half of this video, like, quite a few days later, because <laughs> I didn't, I needed to make an edit, and I honestly didn't really have any good editing software uh, at the time that I was originally filming this, but uh, good news, I finally got editing software, so, um, you know, hopefully I'll be able to make some more scripted videos and scripted content and stuff like that soon. Um, but for now, I'm gonna continue with Portal 2. Hopefully, Continue Game should send me right back to where the last video left off. Um, so yeah, I might sound... Um, I don't know, maybe I sound a bit different or something in this video, I don't know. Uh, again, it's... I, I've recorded this part a few days uh, from the other part, so... Oh yeah, I get to do this again. Woo! <laughs> that's kind of terrifying. Uh, that's fine, just don't look down. But yeah, I'm really sorry for taking so long to get to this video. I needed editing software and I was not able to get any for a while. I was... I don't know, it's kind of hard to explain. Also, I'm not really sure why the portal gun is not actually showing up on my uh, screen anymore. But, um, yeah, for whatever reason... Uh... It's, it's not showing up on the screen. Oh, oh, I gotta jump. I gotta jump, bounce, and go up there. That's what I have to do. Oh my god. I am a smart boy. Oof. Oh, in case you got covered in that repulsion gel, here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this, it's a lively one. And it does not like the human skeleton. Well, that's fun. Yeah, skeletons are overrated anyway. Who fucking needs them? <laughs> All these science spheres are made of asbestos, by the way. Keeps out the rats. Let us know if you feel a shortness of breath, a persistent dry cough, or your heart stopping. Because that's not part of the test. That's asbestos. Good news is the lab boys say the symptoms of asbestos poisoning show a median latency of 44.6 years. So if you're 30 or older, you're laughing. Worst case scenario, you miss out on a few rounds of canasta. Plus, you forwarded the cause of science by three centuries. I punch those numbers into my calculator, it makes a happy face. Fair enough. <laughs> Um. Hmm. 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 Oh 
Okay. And, uh... Huh. I like your style. You make up your own rules, just like me. Bean counter said I couldn't fire a man just for being in a wheelchair. Did it anyway. Ramps are expensive. <laughs> Damn, that's rude. Okay, let's see. What's this? Is that blue gel? Yep. When in doubt, just cover uh, literally everything in gel. Oh wait, hold on. That probably wasn't right, hold on. I think I know what I need to do over there. Okay, I think, I think that's fine. Okay, so I want, no. You go right there in the middle. I'm still probably not going to over-edit these videos too much. Um, the gameplay videos, I mean. I, I do want to make more heavily, like, edited content. But probably not these gameplay videos. These, I, I don't know. I like how they are now, but I'll just make edits when I need to. Um, like, I don't really want anyone's voice except mine getting in this, because, uh, I don't know, it'll just sound weird. Uh, oh my god. I am super dumb. Oh. Hold on. Okay. I need to go back up there. Uh huh. Put that there and boom. There we go. Heads up, that coffee we gave you earlier had fluorescent calcium in it, so we can track the neuronal activity in your brain. There's a slight chance the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. That's good. Yeah. <sighs> If you're part of control group Kepler-7, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees, so we're going to need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty fast. Yeet. Okay, so that turns off the water, but then, uh, okay, hold on, I think I see, oh my god, wall, don't fight me, the wall is fighting me, I'm not okay with it. There we go, okay, okay, uh... Uh... Oh, wait, off. Oh. I'm so dumb. Oh well. Come on, come on, come on. Yeet. 
I'm telling them, keep your pants on. All right, this next test may involve trace amounts of time travel. So, word of advice, if you meet yourself on the testing track, don't make eye contact. Lab boys tell me that'll wipe out time entirely, forward and backward. So, do both of yourselves a favor and just let that handsome devil go about his business. Understood. Remember, if a future you tries to warn you about this test, don't listen. Sure thing. It'd be it'd be really funny if like you've like if you've played this game before and you're like replaying it, they actually made it so that uh like you could see uh the past version. I mean, I guess it wouldn't really be a future version. But it'd be funny if they made it so you could see, like, a, a past version of yourself doing just this test. Uh, let's see. If I go up here, what do we have up here? We don't got a lot. Okay. We still don't got a lot. Okay. What if I do the... Okay. If I do that, then it'll bounce me up there and then into there, I think. Whoa! <sighs> okay. Next test. Uh, accidents hurt. You will be hurt. Co-workers, don't endanger others. The company replacements are costly. Science investigations impede progress. <laughs> Safety first. Alright, so... Uh, basically, don't fuck up. Is... Basically what you're saying. Oh, wait, okay. So that's the other test from earlier. I want to go back down there. Can I... No? Oh, wait. That's blue over there, so... Aha! Aha! I have... I have a smart in, in my head. I have a... I have a big smart in there. Yes! Uh, okay. Whoa. If you're hearing this, it means you're taking a long time on the catwalk between tests. The lab boys say that might be a fear reaction. I'm no psychiatrist, but coming from a bunch of eggheads who wouldn't recognize the thrill of danger if it walked up and snapped their little pink bras, that sounds like projection. They didn't fly into space, storm a beach, or bring back the gold. No, sir, we did. It's you and me against the world, son. I like your grit. Hustle could use some work, though. Now let's solve this thing. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God. Can I jump into this? Eh. I'm gonna break the glass, no? Can't do that? Alright, 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 slow down, okay, hold on, just, okay, just, okay, alright, just, okay, just, let me, okay, just, alright, just, <laughs> just give, okay, just, hold, hold, <sighs> nope, okay, that's not okay, uh, 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 <sighs> oh, I can wash it off here, cleanse my cube of its sins, I'm sorry, uh, alright. Is that portal surface? 
guess. Oh wait, that. Hold on. What am I doing? Where am I even going? Like, which way am I supposed to? Oh, there. Okay, so there's a lift thing here. Oh, that's what the box is for, dumbass. Uh, I'm a dumbass, you guys aren't dumbasses, don't worry. Obviously not. <laughs> oh, wait. on the cube. Does that work? No. That? No. There we go. Why don't you just, like, record it? Like, these are all pre-recorded messages. So he felt it necessary to make a pre-recorded message of him firing someone uh, and just play it randomly during tests. Congratulations! The simple fact that you're standing here listening to me means you've made a glorious contribution to science. As founder and CEO of Aperture Science, I thank you for your participation and hope we can count on you for another round of tests. We're not going to release this stuff into the wild until it's good and damn ready, so as long as you keep yourself in top physical form, there will always be a limo waiting for you. Say goodbye, Carolyn. Goodbye, Carolyn. She is a gem. <laughs> All right, let's go through here. I had a feeling I was going to have to go through there at some point. So we got some tubes, gel tubes, gel pumps, whatever. Uh, all right. What's, what's, what, what's, what? Oh god. Okay, hold on. Uh sorry, I need to Oh god, I need uh uh orange shit. Sorry, I'll get it on the next one. Orange Orange you glad I I I put the right color portal there. Ha 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 Alright, let's turn the gel on. Sounds good. Let's go. I recently watched, um... I don't think I saw the whole thing, but I saw some streams of, uh... If you guys have ever heard of Project Melody, the freaking hentai girl, um... Who I don't, who I definitely don't know about at all. Uh, okay, I'm not even gonna. ...in the 1968 Senate hearings on missing astronauts. And you've most likely used one of the many products we invented, but that other people have somehow managed to steal from us. Black Mesa can eat my bankrupt... Sir, the testing? Right. 
Now you might be asking yourself, Cave, just how difficult are these tests? What was in that phone book of a contract I signed? Am I in danger? Let me answer those questions with a question. Who wants to make $60? Cash. You can also feel free to relax for up to 20 minutes in the waiting room, which is a damn sight more comfortable than the park benches most of you were sleeping on when we found you. So, welcome to Aperture. You're here because we want the best, and you're it. Nope. Couldn't keep a straight face. Anyway, don't smudge up the glass down there. In fact, why don't you just go ahead and not touch anything unless it's test-related. Anyway, as I was saying, uh, Project Melody did, like, a stream where she was playing this before. Which is funny, because from, like, I had heard of her before, and I thought she was just, like, doing, you know, chatterbait stuff. Uh... But, uh, no, apparently she's been streaming games on Twitch as well, which I think is, uh, pretty cool. Uh, so yeah, I actually watched a little bit of her stream. Uh, it was fun. Do, uh, does anything in here do anything? I don't remember. What am I... What am I... What am me do? Wait, I think I have to get down there, right? Or can I just... Oh! Okay. Is that open? That opens. Uh... This might be an extra long playthrough uh, video, just because I, I have no idea how long I've already been streaming. So I'm kind of just like, eh. What, er, not streaming, sorry, recording. Because uh, this is going to be spliced together with the last one of these that I did that I had to quit early. Although maybe I won't go too long because I am actually boiling right now because I had to turn off all the all the fans in here to make sure that there was no fan noise in this recording. And uh whew. Oh, can I okay, hold on. No, wrong color, dumb. Don't be a big stupid. All right. Okay. That's good. That's great. That's fantastic. Oh wait, wait, no! Oh, I made it. I made it. Solid. Done. Did it. I'm a genius. A oh, hi. It didn't even peck you. Oh, okay, now it's pecking you. Uh, I don't know, GLaDOS. You, you, you were kind of rude before. Uh, I'll, I'll have to think about it for a while. Oh, look, computers. Oh, look, a thing. Alright, alright, fine. If I have to. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can figure out. Sorry, I'm just gonna quickly see if I can figure out why the portal gun is not showing up. Cause it looks weak. Cause I can't see Glados now.
Okay, no idea. I guess we'll just have to listen to GLaDOS. I'll try and figure it out before the next video. Can I go in there now? Yes! Alright, so we got GLaDOS. We have a- we have a friend. Well, friend- a frenemy. We have a frenemy. <laughs> Game window just kind of bugged out on my screen, so hopefully that won't look too bad in the recording. The testing area is just up ahead. The quicker you get through, the quicker you'll get your 60 bucks. Oh, Carolyn, are the compensation vouchers ready? ready? Yes, yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. Johnson. Boy, did I just... Who is that? What the hell is going on here? Right, well, good night. Welcome to the Nickelodeon Kids' Choice Awards. Are you ready to get slimed? Uh, alright. Let's see here. Okay. Oof, I thought I was gonna die for a second. That would've been, uh... Kinda lame, honestly. That happened. I would not. I would not have been super happy about it. Okay. So that's orange. So now I just need to put orange down there and it should solve all of my problems in life oof okay ooh 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 ooh, ooh. okay that's fine there, you go there. Whirrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
We just need to relax. We're still going to find out what the hell's going on here, but calmly. Reminder, if you see an orange jumpsuit, hit the red button. That is a thing. Cave Johnson and presumably Carolyn. They look so familiar. Uh, probably because they used to be the CEOs of the company, and also she's in your brain. Spoiler. Whoa, this guy just won a yacht for sixty dollars. Are they trying to convince people that they can buy a yacht with sixty dollars? Remember, alert your supervisor if you see it. inspector, depth of energy inspector, GAO accountant, undercover police officer, nuclear regulatory commission, FEMA coordinator. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, whatever. I think we can continue with the tests now. Okay. So that one is orange, and this one is presumably blue. Yep. <sighs> okay. So... Okay, hold on. Is that what I want to do? I don't think that's what I want to do. I think this is what I want to do. And then... Hold on a minute. Uh, and we can just paint the end of that with blue, and then we're we're good. Oof. Okay, so there's no railing there. So, if I run into a blue portal down there, and I pop out an orange one over here, that should help me a lot in getting over there. Okay, so I cannot move that orange portal, so I need to remember blue. Okay. There we go. Listen up down there. That thing's called an elevator, not a bathroom. I swear I know him. Mm-hmm. Uh, I think I'm probably going to do one more test and then I'm going to end it. Or... Actually, I don't know. If you're Hold interested on. in an additional $60, flag down a test associate and let him know. You could walk out of here with 120 weighing down your bindle if you let us take you apart, put some science stuff in you, and then put you back together. Good as new. That sounds great. Okay. So we got yellow and blue gel there. We got a bunch of portal surfaces over here. And then we got that. We have to make it over there by jumping there? Hold on, I'm just going to try and get a better look over there. Jeez, alright. Yeah, okay, so I got to jump over here. That is probably not going to be enough momentum just with that ramp, though. Although, I will try and get some momentum going on that ramp. Or 
or maybe I want the blue one that ramp. Yeah, I think I want blue one that ramp. I, I somewhat remember this test a little bit. And I think it's blue you want on that ramp, and then the yellow goes over there. So that you can... Run... Get, get momentum some... Okay, hold on. Is this literally all I need? Or do I need to first? Hold on. Let's see what happens if I do this. Oh. Let's just, uh, let's just head back. I think we want a blue there, and we want to put blue on that thing, right? That's what I think. That sounded scary. That's fine. I have a box. Which, I don't know what the hell that means, but you know, I, I have it. Jeez, I'm boiling hot. I need to end the video after this test. And just take a break. Okay. Let's see, let's see. Where does this button go? I don't, I don't know where button go. Probably gonna regret this, but YOLO! <gasps> okay, so I need. I had slightly too much momentum. So maybe if I just start running from a different position, that'll help somehow? I don't know. Like, I won't, like, I won't get as much momentum, uh, if, if I don't, okay. Well, what if I push this cube on here? Had to ask. Back we go. Yeehaw. Okay. I just realized I'm leaning back from my mic more than I usually do. Hopefully, uh, I still sound okay. I I'm gonna try and make the audio a bit louder in my videos uh, with the editing software. But hopefully, hopefully I sound okay. Uh, bah, 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 bah. Okay, okay, slow down, slow. <laughs> Maybe I should try just the orange gel. If I if I do that, that will probably help. 
I still find it weird that I can't see my portal gun. I, I don't... I literally have no idea how I did that. Um... Wait, okay, so I want to do that there. And I want an orange one. Don't you fucking fall on me. Okay, that should... I'll let it go one more time just to be sure. That should be good. Okay, let's try it without any gel on the damn thing then. Oh wait, I can't I can't wash it off. There's no water. At least I don't think. Come on. I really want to finish it off after I've like completed a test. I really don't want to be like halfway through a test in a video, but that might end up, uh, how this is gonna go. Okay, whatever. Whatever. Let's, let's just try this with less momentum. I can't remember if I already tried that. But fuck. Whatever. Okay, so less momentum will work. That's good. It's just not this time I undershot it. <sighs> There's a lot of trial and error going on here. That's fine, though. It's a good thing video games give you infinite lives. Wish real life did that. <laughs> God damn it! One more. <laughs> One more try. Oh my god. One more goddamn try. Alright, but. Thank you guys for watching this video. <laughs> Alright, um, so, yeah, yeah, you know what, I'm calling it, I'm, I need, I need a break, I'm boiling hot, uh, th thank you guys so much for watching, uh, let me just, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, uh, like the video if you liked it, dislike it if you didn't, uh, I'll, I'll see you in a probably tomorrow. I'm I, at a ramp up video making again, and now I have editing software. I have no excuse. <laughs>